Alright, what's going on guys? Um, installing the hydro handbrake, easy way, or a hydro handbrake. First thing you gotta do, get yourself a hydro handbrake. You can either use a um, clutch master, from like a Civic or something, for inline or um, run dual brakes. I cheaped out and I just got a $50 eBay special. So you wanna get that, get it mounted up. I've just got a bit of flat bar, some wood, don't give a fuck. Get it mounted up however you want to do it. Then you got to have somewhere to tap into your brake lines. Mine has this union fitting already underneath the driver's seat. So I've just taken that off. Gone down to my local uh, shop to get fittings and whatnot. Got some braided line and all the fittings I need. I'm using banjos just to get it 90'd out. I want it to sit upside down so I don't have any um, fittings coming to the top just because it will annoy the shit out of me. So yeah, I've got all this. You're going to need a few fittings. You're going to need fittings that will go onto your standard brake line. You need fittings to go onto your master cylinder. This way, well it's all in hydro handbrake in New South Wales is illegal anyway so it doesn't fucking matter. This is like do it yourself sort of line so you just what you do is you get your fitting and then you got the nut nut goes on the line anyway nut goes on the line you fray out the braided put collar on in between the braided and the plastic line or Teflon line, and you put that in it, and you do it up, basically. I'll, I'll do one properly when I get everything mounted in situ. This collar creates the seal, so don't forget the fucking collar. So I'm going to keep going with this. I've already got one line, one line, uh, one line end put on the line, so I'm going to go down to the car, screw it on, Run the line, cut the line, you can just cut this with um, tin snips and it'll happen like that and you've got to straighten everything up and put everything together. Alright. Alright guys, I'm back at it. Got the lines run through the inspection plate. I'll put some um, sealing around that. Doing the line ends, put the nut on first. Make sure you put that nut on first. I've been caught out three times. So, you got to flare out the, the braid from the Teflon, nylon, whatever the hell it is line. I'm trying to get a good shot. Anyway, you can kind of see it's flared out. Don't trim the braid. It's supposed to be like that. The little collet needs to go in it. Like so. It goes onto the plastic line. Just give it a little squeeze. Bring the nut back up. Of course, doing this one handed is always fun. Get your fitting. This is um, braided fitting to AN. Ugh. Come on. Oh, I'll put this down for a sec. Hold on. Alright, it's back on. <laughs> uh, it just needs two hands for this job. Now, the nut gets slid down over the braid. Like so. And... You thread it on, just like that. And then you tighten it up, of course. Oh. And then you run it over to your your fitting, and you screw it on, just like. I need to get a shorter banjo bolt. This one bottomed out already. Which is kind of annoying, but I have to go out and get some sealing anyway for the floor. And you put it on like that, 
and you make sure it wobbles all about. You do another one. Boop. And blow your brakes. Alright, I'll come back when I get everything fucking sorted again. Alright, um, this is third, third shoot of hydro handbrake. As you can see, it's all plumbed up and fitted and all the lines are run handbrake is bleated or back brakes bleated I have already used this so I went to a drift night on Friday night and it works awesome um, back here I'll go under the car as you can see all sealed up no water coming in Got the lines running to here. That's where that brake union was, as you can see. Zip ties to hold everything in so it doesn't rattle about. And yeah, that's how you install a braided brake line with a uh, hydraulic handbrake with braided brake line. Uh, I'll put a little bit of um, tubing here, plastic tube, just so the uh, Standard brake cable, which is useless for drifting, doesn't rub through the line. Just zip tie on each end to hold it from moving about. Because the standard ha handbrake is on the wrong side of the steering wheel, because it's meant for a bench seat. So that's how you install a hydraulic handbrake.